welcome dear students to our english class kindly keep your english grammar books english grammar notebooks close at hand wishing all my dear students a lovely day yes today here we are gathered to continue with chapter 16 comprehension last week in the last week's video i had given you all the english uh, lesson number 7 that is little red yes let us uh, chapter 7 little red we have completed our comprehension from that okay today we will do one comprehension a poet yes we will do a poem comprehension from our bb book so let's see which poem we have got here for you okay before that we will again one time re revise what is a comprehension okay what is a comprehension a comprehension is ability to understand something again here i am repeating it again and again in each and every video for you all is to understand how will you understand something when you are going to read it with full concentration so children what you are going to do you are going to read whatever is given to you slowly nicely and try to understand the meaning of what is written in that okay it is it can be a picture composition comprehension it can be a story a passage or it can even be a poem okay it or it can even be a poem comprehension so here we are going to see a poem comprehension yes that is i love little pussy okay the name of the comprehension is i love little pussy it's on page number 12 of your bal bharati textbooks your bb textbooks page number 12 you are going to open to yes i hope you are all having a bal bharati books so you all can read along with teacher now see how teacher is going to read and we are going to try to understand first what this poet is trying to tell us i love little pussy i love little pussy her coat is so warm and if i don't hurt her she'll do me no harm so i'll not pull her tail or drive her away but pussy and i will very gently play i'll sit by the fire and give her some food and pussy will love me as i am gentle and good i love my little pussy very much so now what is this poet about this whole poem is about a pet and the pet is a little pussy cat now little pussy cat now you seen pussy cat children pussy cat has a very very warm coat their fur on their body na it's very very warm yes their skin is very very soft so you can see that the fur what is there makes them have maybe the pussy cats very very warm i love little pussy her coat is so warm now why are they saying it's a coat you can see the the fur of the cat they are calling that cat's fur as a coat and if i don't hurt her now you all know very well if you all go and hurt any animal purposely okay if the animal is not doing anything to you if you go and try to hurt that animal the animal will get frightened and when the animal get frightened it might directly come and attack you also and if i don't hurt her she will do me no harm so that means if you go and hurt pussy cat you go and do something to her you pull her tail you pull her ears then she will get angry and she will harm you but here what the poet says if i don't hurt her she will also not hurt me she will not do any harm for me so i'll not pull her tail or drive her away see how the poet is thinking how he, uh, the poet can hurt her how this girl can hurt her by not pulling her tail if you pull the tail cat will get angry pussy cat or drive her away if you drive the pussy cat away the uh, pussy cat feels bad but pussy and i very gently will play i'll sit by the fire now why she is saying sit by the fire because it may be cold at that day time yes so she's sitting by the fire to get warm and she is going to give little food to pussy cat also at the same time she's going to sit by the fire warm herself and give pussy cat little food to eat and pussy will love me as i am gentle and good if you are good your pets animals will also love you very much 
I love my little pussy very much. Okay. Now I hope you'll all have understood what this uh, poem is about. I love little pussy. This whole poem is about a little girl who is talking about how much she loves her pussy cat. Again, one more time, we will read the poem and then we will start answering the question and answers. I love little pussy. Her coat is so warm. And if I don't hurt her, she'll do me no harm. So I'll not pull her tail or drive her away. But pussy and I very gently will play. I'll sit by the fire and give her some food. And pussy will love me as I am gentle and good. I love my little pussy very much. So now what you are going to do, you are going to take your grammar notebooks. Yes, write in the grammar notebook. Please write this again in the homework section. These are all I am giving you all for your practice so that you will learn how to read, understand and answer comprehensions. I have sent you all two videos now. One video is a prose comprehension. This is a poetry comprehension. Okay, prose is done and this is a poem, a poetry comprehension. Now children, these two are only for examples. I am going to give you all in the live class uh comprehension question and answers which you are going to answer on your own so better be prepared write today's date 20-9-21 read the poem bb page 12 and answer the following questions question one how is the coat of little pussy answer little pussy's coat is warm leave a line Question two, if little pussy is hot, what will she do? If someone hurts little pussy, she might harm them too. If little pussy is hot, what will she do? If little pussy is hot, if someone hurts little pussy, she might harm them too. What you are going to do now, children here? Yes, I know that you all know this very well. Pause the screen. Take your notebooks and with your own handwriting, you are going to write all these questions and answers neatly. Are you going to ask mommy and daddy to write? No, you are going to write them on your own. Let's go to question three. How will the poet play with little pussy? Answer, the poet will play the poet will very gently play with little pussy. Gently means very kindly, not hurting, taking care of her. The poet will play very gently with little pussy. Question four. Where will the poet sit and give food to little pussy? Answer. The poet will sit by the fire and give little pussy food. Why you think the poet is sitting at the fire? Yes, I told you all the poet may be sitting near the fire because it is cold. Yes, and to warm herself, the poet is sitting near the fire and she is giving little pussy food to eat. Okay, she is taking care, good care of little pussy. Leave a line, question five. Write rhyming words for harm. Harm, warm. Harm, warm. Rhyming word for harm, warm. Warm. Harm. These are the rhyming words for harm and warm. Let's go to the next. Question six. Write a word from the paragraph which means kind or mild. Kind. Being kind or mild answer is gentle. I told you. Gentle means very being very kind or being very mild with, the, with that cat. Question seven. Write a sentence with coat. I wear my warm coat on cold days. I wear my warm coat on cold days. Again, pause the screen and please write the question and answers very neatly in your notebooks. Children, I will be checking your question and answers anytime. I hope you all are going, writing it down neatly. Please keep writing your question and answers and study. Next. So what you're going to do, study all this and get ready for the comprehensions which I will be giving you all in your life class or I will be sending you all on your WhatsApp group also so that you all start solving and uh, 
getting ready for your final exam term exam so for your homework what you are going to do complete work given in the homework section of your grammar notebook complete all the work what is given in this video write it down in your homework section of your grammar notebook see children i am telling you all very well again and again do not mix your books okay do not mix your books write all those things correctly in your grammar book and i will be checking it out again and okay in the live class also <coughs> children stay healthy be happy thank you